Nigeria Association of Pharmacists in Academia, NAPA, has stressed the need to apply modern innovative techniques in teaching. This was as they held their annual conference in Abuja with the theme, Innovative Disruption in Pharmaceutical Teaching and Research. The president of the Pharmaceutical Society of Nigeria, Sam Uhuabungwa, says there is a need for pharmacists in the academia to upgrade their knowledge and use of information technology so as to effectively transfer such to the next generation of pharmacists. This conference is building on the theme of innovative disruption, which is the theme that runs in all our activities this year as a pharmaceutical society of Nigeria. Today we are looking at how that can be applicable to academic pharmacists in terms of teaching, in terms of research. What kind of disruptive innovation would they use to make sure that they are producing pharmacy graduates who are relevant, who can live and practice in the 21st century dynamic environment, who are conversant with the changes that are taking place, who know how to deal with issues of globalization. We are all out to bring about the standard education like anywhere in the world as far as pharmacy is concerned. We think about the ethics of the practice and we think of, about disruptive technology. That is why the theme of this conference, they are talking of disruption as far as teaching and uh, uh, research is concerned. Mark you, from the way we see technology going, uh, very soon you will hear that uh, when you take tablets with a sensor, small sensor into your stomach, which is digestible, will be able to send message to the physician that yes, the absorption, the digestion of the product is going well. Uh, this is the position. And of course, there is what we call 3D technology. Uh, in the pharmacy or at home, you can be able to print your tablet and swallow it very well. So we have to look at, it's not, pharmacy is a global profession. We just don't want to stay in Nigeria and say, look, we want to do Nigeria and we know. We have to think ahead of time and how do we change our curriculum to fit into the system 